I want to show you something because we've known each other. How long have we known each other? Can you remember? My gut instinct is it's when we first were doing, Ricky and I were doing extras. Let me just check this BAFTA to see if that is the right thing. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> Very good. Now look at that, do you remember that? I don't remember that, but you, you look very handsome in that picture. And also, I don't, I, we must have staged that. I don't think you and I have ever had that much joy together. You don't, there's no need to say that. What you're doing there is you're lashing out with humour. And if you take anything <laughs> away from this encounter, it's just, just let the love flow, as the Bellamy <laughs> brother said. People may not know, Steve, Steve has a place in, in Los Angeles talk about living the dream and when I was working over there a while ago you were very kind enough to, to rent me a room. Do you remember what we did? We had a lot of fun and um, bats and I remember we went round to open houses in LA they do that thing quite it's quite common they just have open houses and, and it's for houses that are for sale and you, you don't really need an appointment you can essentially just drop in if you see a sign. Yeah. And uh, yeah, so we, but we went around to the, the, the most expensive houses we could find. I recall there was one that appeared to have a screening room slash nightclub in the basement with a uh, stripper's pole. Yes, 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 <laughs> yes. And you wasted no time. You were up on that stage. Some of the stuff that you were doing for a man with your center of gravity. Listen, you know, when you're as nimble as me and as tall as me and with these these gorgeous leg, I'm very much a leggy blonde. And, and so the stripper's pole is my natural habitat. This, I think, is just after we viewed that house. We've seen uh, a, a property, a second property. How would you how would you sum it up? Um, if I wanted to branch into making uh, high class porn, it's the house for me. Uh, very clean lines. Uh, not for long. Not for long. Uh, an infinity pool that looks out over a spectacular view of the uh, sea. So what's the re the main thing that's putting you off it? Currently it's the seven and a half million dollar price tag. Right, and you're feeling, is that you're not comfortable with that price? <laughs> I feel it just may be a little excessive. Yeah, um, yeah. You know, I don't really want to spend more than uh, $250,000. Do you remember the woman that was showing us around? I remember you sort of pranking her by constantly encouraging me to either put in an offer or say that I was very interested in making the purchase, which may be very uncomfortable because of course, once they get a sniff of blood like a shark, they're onto you, or they're not gonna let you go without fight. <laughs> All right, well, listen, it's been a delight. Is there anything you want to get off your chest as a friend or just from a legal basis be before we wrap this up? Not really, except to say, obviously, I wish you the very best with the, uh, what do you call this, a, a vodcast? Um, I'm calling it, it's, it's my YouTube channel. Yeah. 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 Sure, sure, sure. Um, Everybody's and, doing it now, all the, all the young dudes. I think MC Hammer's got one up and running. I oh, hear. God, yeah. No, I, I, think, I think my postman's got one. <laughs> yeah, no, I, it, I, like I say, I think, I think everyone's doing this.